one of the most challenging things in my life is figuring out what I want it to be. Snowboarding is just living to me. It's not really play, it's not work, it's just I'm fine living. Craig is a guy who's teaching us all about how to live. He blends into the mountain. He becomes a part of it versus invading upon it. Paradise always seems like it's just around the corner, like the next trip I'm going to do or the next run I'm going to take. Maybe even the next turn I'm going to make. I never really feel like I'm completely there. But I guess that's just within myself to figure out. Well, we've got a Lulu for you tonight. It's called snowboarding. Like, snowboarding is not simply a sport. It was my calling, you know, the first time I ever saw it. We went from being just, you know, not even a fly in the windshield. Then we were sort of like a nuisance for a while. It's all those snowboarders. And then we became like a threat. And then all of a sudden, we were the saviors. Yeah, Jake, you're the man, you know. Craig just went out there and won. He was world champion. He determined the style of riding. Taking it to a limit that the rest of us didn't realize we could take it to. He is directly responsible for any success I ever had. Craig always set a good example, you know, if it, always, you know, in the public eye. I remember uh, being with him in vehicles and uh, wanting to get out. We were insane at that time. There was a little incident. Bang, 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 something hit the wall. Craig just busts through the door. He goes, damn, 20 floors of hotel is destroyed. The next day was not that funny. We didn't know any better. <laughs> <laughs> it's kind of a, a weird balance of things up there. Craig was it, you know, he had a magical power, there's no question. I don't think anybody believed Craig would leave. I mean, he was too good at it. Craig was always seeking something. He wanted to bring out the best in other people. He wanted to help them experience the passion that he had for the mountains. That's what it was for him, it was spiritual. People lose their lives up there all the time trying to get that peak, and I like the fact that it's elusive. It's the ultimate personal challenge. I mean, you're putting your life on the line for what some people feel is an absolutely stupid reward. And just trying to enjoy the journey.